Hello everyone, in this tutorial we are going to use this short calculator to evaluate derivative of a function at certain value. Uh, most of the times in physics and in calculus you are given an equation of a position of something or acceleration of something um, and then they are, you will be asked to find the acceleration or velocity at uh, a certain points so let's say you are given this equation and you want to take the derivative and evaluate it at 5 so taking the derivative and then evaluating at 5 yes it can be done with hand but calculator can make it easy and uh, sometimes if you need to evaluate it at multiple values that would be very very handy so now let's do this to evaluate the derivative we press this button d over dx so I press shift and this one and this at this screen at the top so d of this function this function goes here with respect to x so my values are x so now let's enter 3x squared 3 to enter x and all these value that uh, that are bluish color so I press alpha and then x then square my calculator has faded because this calculator is very good calculator but the button and the new layout is very bad it loses the color if it comes with contact with other objects so minus 6 and then alpha and then x plus 4 so I've entered my values now uh, now we want to evaluate it at 5, so with the right arrow, go to the right, so here at 5. I press equal sign, so that is the derivative is taken, and then 5 have been entered into that equation, so it's 24. If you want to evaluate it at some other value, with the left arrow, just press it, and then backspace, let's say 1.2. So that's the value, and I'm pressing this button to get decimal value now let's do some evaluating of an integral the same way you want to calculate a, a definite integral so from minus 1 to 8 so meaning I have to take the integral of this function plug in this value into the taken integral subtract it so to do that simple so this button is already here without shift you just press it so the cursor is already at the lower bound so I press this minus button here so uh, backspace minus one and then with the right arrow you can go up it and then right arrow come here and enter our equation so cosine of so that is my cosine, open a parenthesis, 2 and then x for x I press alpha and x and then close it, plus, now this is 1 over a over b, so at the top I enter x squared alpha and then x, I press the wrong button, x squared and then with a lower arrow I can come down, Two. my equation has been entered exactly as I have it just press equal sign it takes a while you will see a, the word busy here that's amazing that um, you see a blank screen I haven't seen it in any other operations except these calculations so it takes a while as you can see I'm just waiting together let's see how long it takes <laughs> okay so 94.396 so this was a tutorial from equator.com I hope you have enjoyed it